sinking of the Titanic started in 1909 in February in Belfast, Ireland. On the 10th of April, the Titanic got launched from Southampton, England. On the 15th of April at 11.40, the Titanic hit an iceberg. The first lifeboat got launched at about 12 a.m. The last lifeboats got launched at about five minutes past two. Carpathia arrived at the Titanic scene at about nine to, nine to ten in the morning. The Carpathia arrived in New York on April 16th at about 12 p.m. On the Carpathia, lots of people were looking for family. Well, I know it's going to be amazing, so I can't just—I just can't wait to go on the biggest ship in the world. It's going to be so good. Titanic is so impressive. I'm so glad I spent all my money on a first-class ticket. How does it feel to be in the Titanic? Good. Bringing anyone with you? I've got my daughter with me. Ladies. She's 18 and I'm 42. Wait, what's your names? I'm, I'm, I'm John Jacob Astor and she is Madeline. Um, so what age are you again? Uh, I'm 42. Old man. She, she can't say anything, you're, you're 62. Good point. Um, got to start on your life in New York. Yeah, but I've, I was born there, so I'm, so I'm going back home. Your parents still there? Yeah. Um, you got to start on your job? Yeah. Where well, you got workers? A money maker. Good. Hello, can you tell me your name and what you're all about? My name is Miss Anna Sophia Nyston and I'm a first class passenger. Oh, excellent. Thank you for sharing that with us. How are you feeling at this moment? I felt I was feeling very um, excited at the same time, but also nervous. I'm sure you were. Why are you feeling so excited and a little bit nervous? Because I was, I I was excited because I was sailing the greatest and mightiest and biggest ship in the whole entire world, and I was feeling. I was feeling a bit nervous just in case if I don't, I get seasick and I embarrass myself in front of the other passengers. Understandable. What's your name, Miss? Gladys. Gladys Cherry. Are you travelling with anyone? <sighs> or are you tired? Yes, and I'm travelling with Molly. How are you? Freezing. Oh dear, there's no need to shout, Gladys. It's not Gladys to you, it's Miss. Oh, okay, Miss, I'm sorry. I can't believe the ship went down. Oh, don't worry, Miss. Everything's going to work itself out. No, it won't. Oh, I can tell you're upset. Would you like me to go away now? Yes, please. Good morning, Isidore. I can see you're absolutely frozen. It's freezing out here. It's terrible what's happened. I don't mean to upset you anymore because I can see... You're really traumatised, but could you give me some indication? What happened when you hit the iceberg? When I hit the iceberg, my entire room just shook. I couldn't even move, neither could my family. Where are your family, Isidore? I can't see any family. It seems like my wife is drowned and my two kids are away somewhere. I don't know, on another lifeboat or something. I hope you're going to be reunited. Hopefully, it's freezing out here. Oh. I must get to New York. You must get to New York and get a blanket. Do yeah. you have any idea how this happened? Why did they not see the iceberg? I think if everyone seems to be blaming the captain. Yeah, is that wrong? The poor captain. I wonder, do you think everyone will have got off the boat alive? Hopefully. I don't want anyone to die. Thank you so much, Isidore. All the very best to you. Good morning, sir. Can you tell me your name and where you've been? My name is Mr. Moritz O'Connor and I'm on the Carpathia right now. How sad are you about the sinking of the unsinkable ship, the Titanic? I'm really sad and I lost my friend Jeff. <coughs> why, why, why? 
it's on Peon, so I like it. Oh. Hello. Hello. What's your name? Robin Hood. How are you, Robin? Good. Good. Are you okay after the crash on the Titanic? I was scared when I saw the iceberg. Oh, was it quite scary? Yeah. Do you remember what happened in the ship? What happened? It was a massive iceberg. A massive iceberg. Are you going to be okay? Yeah. Well, are you glad you survived? Yes. How are your family? Were you travelling alone or were you travelling with your family? You were travelling alone, okay. Did people you know maybe die in it? No. No? Well, you're very lucky. Okay, goodbye. Bye. Good morning. Could you tell me your name, please? My name is Madeline Asper. Oh, Madeline. Could you maybe tell us a little bit about how you felt when the Titanic sank? I felt so, so scared. I thought the Titanic was unsinkable. Yes. And what did you do to get yourself safely off the boat? I went in the first lifeboat. Were you with anyone else? Um, no. You were just alone. And how long did the journey take till you got back to London? Um, I don't know. Did you bring anything with you? No. <laughs> okay, thank you.